I told y'all, um, I'm back with another video. It's today it's gonna be a big video update because I know you guys been wanting that since also JJ channel and now this channel. But before we get started, this new channel, it's not gonna be as good. I'm gonna tell y'all now because like it's only Josh you're gonna see in the videos because both of my two main bad guys from Ultra JJ, they both moved. Um, Wayne moved. He's still in Arkansas. But he moved an hour away from where I live. The other way, he's way in Vegas. So, yeah, there's no more of that. It's just going to be Josh. So, I don't know if you guys just want to see the same person over and over again. Just let me know. But, um, yeah, it's not going to be as good. But, I guess. But, um, yeah, let's just get right into the duty belt update. So, first, I have a mag pouch. Um, two magazines right here. Don't go to any of the guns I carry. No. Let's just go to a spring loaded gun. But... Just keep those right there. And then um a badge I got from um one of my friend grandpa. Um this is security, so he just gave me these. I got one up here too, but yeah, then my cuff key. I lost my um my like pen one, you know. I lost that one one, so I just carry a pen, actual pen right here. Um, I gotta buy me a new one of those, but then my Viper Tech cuffs. Um, all of this stuff is the same. And then my mace. I don't want to take that off, but yeah, same from um. Back then, nothing changed. But well, at least I'm on belt from right now. So okay. No, you know what it is. That's the cat trying to come in. Okay. I'm sorry about that, but, um, yeah, then I have my other cuffs right here. These are chained. These are the same as well. And then, going on to here is my flashlight. This is the same. Right there. And the different thing is my gun right here this is the same holster but a different gun it actually don't even really fit in here it's really loose but we ain't gonna talk about that well right here is the glock 19x bb gun magazine right here y'all if you look familiar with this bb gun or this gun period the base plate don't come like this what happened was i had spray painted it in black but it was always scratching I hate scratches on guns or anything like even my light if it i hate scratches so i was like i can't keep doing this so i just got um sandpaper and sanded it all off so this is imprinted in like that back there the black so it actually stayed and i actually like that it's a pretty cool look so that's why it looked like that and then um of course it's nothing in here it is green gas though because i keep a little in it because they say it's good for the for the magazine and it lasts longer so i keep green gas in there i'm not gonna shoot it because i don't want youtube saying oh it was loaded he had a loaded gun all of that but um as far as y'all can see nothing in it and then right there then i have a light for it um uh, try to put it on stroke all right right there and it got stroke um i actually like it at first i didn't like that gap so i had glued it but then when i went to shooting it i guess the recoil or whatever it had not the light off from the glue the glue wasn't strong enough so i just had to put it back like this and i'm getting used to it so that's this and yeah then up to here i have my fake tourniquet still same this uh all of this same this is visible i don't have to explain any of this right and then my radio and my repel mic everything still work and all oh, my taser i have moved up here from my belt because everything was staying for the moment so i was like i just want this but yeah, and it's actually pretty stable. I had cut, I had to cut between this and I had just put it in there. So it's actually not going nowhere. It's there, you pull on it all you want, but yeah. This is the other badge I was talking about. And yeah, that's all for this. And this is, well, first I'll show you the sling. This is not a real sling. It's just one I put on. I'm not even gonna explain how I made it. Uh, I don't even know. But anyways, this is a fake sling. Or if I had to pull the big little guy out. It's big and small, but okay, so this is the BB gun too. Uh first, it doesn't come anything like this. 
I customized really good, as y'all can see. Like, come on, though. Yeah, you, you feel where I'm coming from. But, yeah, I customized stuff really good. And this stock, or this the stock, but this right here, it comes different. You got to knock the piece out and then take this off and then you put a stock on here. And so then, right here, it comes actually with this red dot. It's pretty cool. And I put this light on it. And I also put this on the magazine. Because it comes like that. I don't like that. So I just put this on it. And it looks very nice. And I had cut the bottom of this off. And it came with two. So if, like, if I ever get tired of that look. I put the other thing on. You know how the little loop thing comes. Right there. I put that back on. The red dot. I wonder if y'all can. No. There's no chance of y'all seeing that red dot. But it definitely worked. And then the rack back. But of course it's unloaded. So it's going to be stuck. Until I take the magazine out. Put this back in. And the light on this. Oh, right here. Right there. And then, I don't know why it's doing that. Oh, stroke right there. It's trying to go on stroke. I'm sorry I'm blinding y'all, but, um, yeah. And the fake sling or whatever, it's like this. Um, okay. This is a belt keeper I got on it. And so, I actually like it. It's pretty cool. This is how I do it. I basically do the belt keeper right. And this is not going anywhere. Right there. It's right there, so, like... Boom, boom, boom. Right there. But. Oh, it's no. It's not a but. It's just something I like about it. Say if, like. I need to. I'm not even going to lie. I need to get something to hold it on my vest. Because that on my neck is not it. So I need to get something, like, to hold it. Strap it onto my vest. Like the other belt keeper or something. But say, like. Boom, boom, boom. You out. Or not you out. I have to think it's going to go to this. Say you shoot it and. Something happened. I don't know. If you need to get this unhooked. There you go. So you just undo the belt keeper and boom, you have it however you want it. But then say if you do need it on you, of course, you're not going to go in to wherever you're going with it off of you. So yeah, if it's on you, it's like that. If you need to hurry up and get it off of you, it's just an easy pull. Boom. So um, I actually been working on, I'm not really finna go out in the shootout, but I've been working on the boom, 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 and then like that. But, yeah, that's really all to it. And, by the way, this is the Crossman A41, I believe. Yeah. I got it from Atwoods for 218 I believe. It's normally like 290 298 something like that. But it came up to 218 But, um, yeah, that's all the customized for the used guns. As well as my um, other Glock 26. I left that because that has nothing to do with this. That's just... It's not nothing to do with this, but um, yeah, that's all the customized I was talking about in the Ultra JJ channel. So, yeah, that's everything. I hope y'all enjoyed this. This is a very long do to go update, but yeah, um, that's pretty much all. And I hope y'all enjoy it. And I'm coming back with more cops and robbers if y'all want it. But like, like I said again, it's only Josh, can't be nobody else because I don't have nobody else. So, like, it's really going downhill. And two, uh, not 2K, GTA is coming next week. If it don't come next week, hold on. No, this is a totally new channel, but same people probably. But I'm going to explain that on, on Watch the JJ channel. But um, yeah, peace out. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and hit the post notification button so you don't miss any of my new videos. And peace out.